you could use it for Halloween or whatever um, it's basically like based on space and stars and stuff so yeah I thought I'd do something similar to my last one but I really liked the moon side of my face I wasn't first in the Sun side but I loved like the colors and how the stars and stuff popped so I'm gonna try and do that like kind of look all over so I'm going to start with my primer, which is this. It's the Skin Hit Soothing Serum by Beauty Bay. Um, this is £5 on Beauty Bay. It's really good for oily skin. Really, really good for oily skin. Okay, primer on. I'm now going to be adding my base, which is this. It's the F F. It's the SFX White Base Face Paint by Revolution. Sorry guys, my cushion is coming off my chair and I don't feel comfortable. That's better. Um, this is $5.99 from Superdrug. So I'm gonna apply this to a beauty blender and just work it into my face. Okay, now that we've done our base, I think I'm gonna just, this sounds crazy, like I should, I wanna start with the blue, but I'm thinking if it's dark, like, and I gotta put light colors on top, then you're not gonna be able to see the lighter colors, are you? So, first of all, actually, I'll put some highlighter on. And the highlighter that I will be using is this it's the beauty bay's own brand highlighter in the shade flash now this was £5.50 when I bought it but I think they've got a deal on at the moment where it's £4.50 I bought one in every single shade because I liked it that much honestly they for the price it's like it's like glass going on it's amazing I love it Okay, I think it's shiny enough. So, I think I'm gonna start with a kind of purple color and just like blend it out through part different patches. Like just do a couple of patches, like three patches of purple and blend it out onto my face. So, I'm going to use the purple out of this, which is my NYX Ultima Edit palette, the, um, the Brights one. And this was £7 on Look Fantastic. I'm just going to apply a little bit and then just blend it out and see what happens. I know this looks really odd, but there is a method to my madness, okay? Um, I 
do a bit of pink as well? I might blend a little bit of pink from the same palette, like in with the purple. Okay. Next, I'm going to be using my Morph palette, 18A, blew you away. This was actually um, eight pound from the Morph website on sale. So it was a really good buy. They always have something, like some sort of sale on there, which is amazing. Um, now the shade from this that I'm gonna take is the self assured one which is this and I'm just going to do the same put patches and spread it So we are getting somewhere guys, I haven't even turned my lights on, I should have done that at the start, but I completely forgot. Wow, I'm bright. Wow, it's very bright actually. Okay, <clears throat> I'm now going to go over the same, but I'm going to add a couple of different um, shades of blue now. So the first one I'm going to add is this, which is Wool Show. I'm just going to add that into the different bits that I have on my face. So that's what we're working with at the moment, which is okay. I need to add some darker shades to it and also some like shimmer shades to it. So I'm just going to use, I'm going to put a few patches of the Sanding O um, shade on my face now. <clears throat> okay, I'm now gonna go in with what shade is that? No, not that shade. Let's have a look at this palette. Ah, okay, here's a nice, nice. Right, this is my Morph 35B palette, Color Burst, and I'm gonna be using the shade um, Great Pop, which is this one here. Okay. So this is what we're working with so far. I mean, let me turn my light off because you can't see it because of the reflection. Probably shouldn't have put so much um, highlighter on that. But this is what we're working with so far. So, I'm now going to put this shade on, 
which is called denim. So I'm just going to add some of that into my face. Okay, I'm now going to go and put some of this colour in here, which is the shade Pixie. I'm just going to put this on top of the, um, on top of here, where we had our pink. So, this is what we're working with now. I'm now going to go back to my previous palette. Shut that first, shall we? Which is the Morph 18A palette, and I'm going to take some silver, the shade um, Autograph, which is this one here. Now, again, I'm just going to blend it in. I'm also gonna go and put some of this shade in it, which is the sapphire blah, 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 sapphire up shade. Right, I'm now also gonna add the shade So Dazzling, which is this one here. Okay, now I am going to add some more of that pink colour to there and to the other places because obviously I've put loads of dark on top of it. So just to brighten it up a little bit. Okay, now we're going to move on to doing our eyes and for that I am going to use... purple from this palette which is this one and this blue here so I'm going to start off with the purple on the inside and then the blue on the outside So now that I've done that, I am just going to blend, blend both colours just in the middle here. So this is what we're working with <clears throat> so far. Now. I will do my lips last. The next thing I'm going to be using is this, which is my Maybelline white eyeliner. I think it was like four pound, three or four pound online. And we're just going to draw some stars and stuff, little dots on your face.
Okay guys, so your face should be looking something like this. I am now going to pop some concealer on my lips. The concealer I'm going to use is this, it's the Muir Pro Base Concealer. I'm just putting it on my lips so I can put some colour on top. Okay, <clears throat> so I've now primed my lips. Um, I'm going to add some colours. I'll probably do the same colour, like one lip blue, one lip pink. Um, similar to what I've done with my eyes. So I'm going to be needing my Ultimate Edit Palette. And I think I'm going to do the bottom one in blue. top lip in this purple colour here. Why I did that I have no idea. <laughs> so I'm also going to put a couple of dots of the eyeliner on my lips too. Okay, I'm not going to go with my lips. They're a little bit like squiggly, but yeah, this is the finished look. So I don't know if you wanted to do like a, I don't know, like a planet girl or something like that. I don't know for your Halloween look. So yeah. Um, I hope you've enjoyed my tutorial. I'm sorry it dragged so long. So much blending and stuff had to go on. It was ridiculous. So, I will leave a link down below to my YouTube channel. I will also leave a link to my Instagram page. And if you could, if you enjoyed this tutorial, then please subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. Um, and that's it for today, guys. I love you all. Have a good weekend.